Hello YouTubers. Let's go out and take a look in the garden and see what we can see. I think we're gonna like it. So this is what we get when we step in. We look to the left. And we've got three beds. Let's see what we got. My mom is the boss of the garden. And she knows what we planted where. I can't say that I do. All I know is it's pretty. Looking good. Cucumbers. That's what we got here. We got cucumbers here. And just around the corner. We got another bed. And uh, I do know that the next bed around is the, uh, what she calls the salad bed. And uh, she's not real happy with the lettuce for some reason. She says it's, uh, it's a little bit bitter. She's going to take that out and we're going to put something else in there. And we've decided that uh, since we've run out of room for uh, the big beds, we're going to just start putting stuff every place we can find. So we'll, you can see we've got a five gallon bucket there with a pepper plant in it. And uh, probably find that those are going to be just uh, here, there, and yonder. I don't know about these potatoes, man. I'll tell you. I never saw potatoes get that tall before. You know, if they're doing as much under as they're doing on top, and I have no reason to think that they won't, man, what a potato crop we're gonna have. I don't, I just, I just don't understand this exactly. Uh, unless they just really, really like that soil. So we'll see what happens. It's gonna be a while. A little while yet, but my gosh, they are, uh, I don't know, they're more than knee high, that's for sure. And here was the last bed. This is the spot where we had the, uh, oh, we had that manure pile over here, and I am so glad to see that gone. We've got to get some more wood chips. I think one more load kind of probably do it for us there. And uh, yeah, it was full. Of, that manure pile was full of rocks. We had to we had to go through it and get all the rocks out. And that was a job, let me tell you. Here's our uh, second planting of tomatoes. And uh, the marigolds are pretty. Yeah, they are. I can't remember what she planted right here. She gets up earlier than I do, and she gets out here and uh, she does a bunch of stuff, and I'm not sure what it all always is. There's the sweet potatoes. I think we had a a bug wanting to eat on those sweet potatoes and we had to put a little dust on them. Anyway, back to the tomatoes. Tomatoes are looking good. Really, really, really good. In fact, I don't, I just don't know of much of anything that's not doing awfully well. I uh, really do like these, these marigolds at the ends. Makes everything look good. Yep, so we got some peppers in with the tomatoes here. Oh, and they're looking good. I tell you though, we're to a point to where we could get dry. And I hope that doesn't happen. We've got a chance of rain, I think, for the next four or five days. But, uh, 
and you never know if it's going to do that or not. So I'm trying to think what this is. I think this is the 8th day of June. So it's probably been about a week since we've done a, an update. I know when I when I show these the ends of these <laughs> this tomato bed here, it always looks the same except uh, for the fact that the tomatoes are just getting taller and taller. And uh, here's some more of those five gallon buckets that uh, I don't know if she's going to leave these here and add the others around or what. But I don't know. I love these raised beds. I just makes everything just look so neat and tidy. Uh, the corn, the corn's growing up good. I kind of put them in there a little bit tight, but uh, I saw where another guy did that, and it worked okay for him. I think I gave him about eight inches square there. So we'll see what happens with that. It's kind of a experiment. And here we got some beans. Now, can't tell you exactly. Oh, oh, yeah, I can. We got a, got a, I think, three rows of Blue Lake. And they're doing real well. Pepper bed. Pepper bed's doing just really good. Got a little bit of manure in the wheelbarrow there. Okay. Keep it covered up. And there's some more <laughs> tall potatoes in another bed. So, I don't know. Anxious to see what's under there, I really am. And over here, on the end, is the last bed that we did. I did this one yesterday, actually. And it's about uh, 20 feet long and about 2 feet wide. Right on the end. So, got this one to plant today, I think. We're going to plant this one today. And I don't know what's going in there besides a few peppers and some more tomatoes. But, it is what it is. And there is the look back to the east. Always looking towards the east, you know. So... And that's all there is for that for now. Just really, 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 really happy with everything the way it's working out. A lot of work, but we think it's worth it.